Politics sparks fly in a scary drama as a woman is driving. A Samsung cell phone is being blamed for a fire that put a woman's life in danger and destroyed her car. She made it out alive, but could others be at risk? Seven investigator Simon Shaquette is digging for answers, and it's only here on 7. As she was driving down the road, a woman says her cell phone caught fire, and what she describes happened in the seconds after is simply a remarkable escape. I was driving down Evergreen. At the corner of my eyes, I see a spark. Asking us not to reveal her identity, this woman describes what she calls a ticking time bomb that caught fire inside her car. She says on the morning of May 21st, she had two cell phones sitting in a cup holder when one of them suddenly caught fire. Samsung um, Galaxy. Uh, S4 and a Galaxy S8. I thought I was going to die when I saw the sparks and the fire. She quickly pulled over and got out as flames engulfed her Nissan Maxima. And it happened quick. It just went up in flames. Um, the people was telling me to get away from the car. What if I was going to be on the highway and stuck in traffic and couldn't you know, get out. We checked fire department records that verify the fire was started by a cell phone. Attorney Gerald Thurswell says his client still suffers emotional scars and trouble sleeping after that scare. While searching online, we found similar complaints about Samsung phones, some that were even banned from airplanes. But Thurswell says neither of these two are on a recall list. We've contacted Samsung and they've been very, very responsible. They sent out a whole crew to examine the car. They sent out engineers to examine what we believe to be portions of the phone. Once it's determined which of the phones and that phone is recalled, we'll probably save lives. In a short statement to us, a Samsung spokesperson says, quote, while we don't comment on pending litigation, we stand behind the safety of the millions of Samsung phones in the United States. So far, no lawsuit has been filed against Samsung. We will stay on top of this story to bring you the latest developments as they happen. Simon Shaykat, 7 Action News. Oh, still so frightening.